Come to classes know this first one. It's a special chi energy gathering technique. What we do, we just have our feet shoulder width apart. Okay, make that circle with that leader, guys. Come in. Okay, we start. We're going to start from the earth. We'll do three times to draw in the energy from the earth into our hearts. Then we lean back as we express that with courage and love and compassion up into the sky, and then we draw from universe into our heart and um, back down into the center three times and then I've got a special <laughs> symbolic story that I wrote that um, we're going to read out too so rightio so feet shoulder width apart hands back to back okay bend your legs and get reach into the earth breathe in imagine drawing in all the energy inside cycle it through lean back and express that from your heart up to the sky and really feel that and then go back down again reaching into the earth draw in the energy deep inside lean back and express that with courage from your heart up to the sky and one more time reaching deep into the earth draw in the energy cycle it through and search that out from your heart with courage and strength and sand and share now we go from the sky upwards, breathe in, and exhale straight into the middle. And rise up, two, breathe in, into your heart, and share that with the earth. And one more time, lean back, draw in the energy from the universe, through your heart, and express that back into the earth. Then your feet come together, you go up, inwards, and over. of its birth there is a golden nectar forming in its core. The heart of this flower is yearning to unfurl itself from within. As the dawning of a new day approaches, the beautiful sunflower is activated into its blossoming journey of life. Its petals begin to peel open. As each individual petal stretches itself outwards from the center, they arch back and surrender to the light. The flower offers the beauty of its heart back towards the radiant sunlight. The light of the sun and the heart of the flower have merged together as one in the cosmic dance of light, each a blessing to the other. The sun nurtures the flower with its light and as the flower receives its nurturance, it also shares its beauty back out into the world. The heart of the flower thus is pollinated by nature and its core is seeded with new life. When the time is ripe, its seeds are spread by the wind or carried by the wind to new regions of land, to new shores of existence. The beautiful sunflower 
has made its cyclic transition. It has journeyed full circle. Having transferred its essence, it returns now back to its first source of creation. And with a deep sense of gratitude, a new awareness is born that there is a powerful new calling for universal peace and understanding, that the entire cosmos is alive upon this blossoming path of life, its rhythms and its cycles. With a deep in-breath and out-breath, there is an expansion and contraction in its tides and its flows and within its sacred waves of existence. At the very heart of creation, we are all one with this essence, and with courage and maturity, we shall one day come face to face, and through the grand portal of love and acceptance, we will look one another in the eyes, and regardless of any differences in appearance, we shall all honour and respect one another. And it is within the heart of this realisation that we all shall understand and remember that we all share the same home and we all share the same source. And just as the earth for our children is like a wondrous playground and it's full of adventure and discovery. And so it is that the entire cosmos will be shared as our home with beings from other galaxies becoming our new friends. and our embrace and no matter who we are and whereabouts that we live there is one thing that we all most certainly have in common is that our first source of creation has seeded us all with the sacred attribute of love namaste with strength and courage forever Us. Us. Made it to the very end.